Hi, I'm Dr. Adrienne Randolph, Director of the Kennesaw State University Brain Lab. Here at the Brain Lab, I conduct research on the design and application of brain-computer interfaces. What are brain-computer interfaces? They allow us to control computers and devices using just our thoughts, completely hands-free, so that no muscular input is needed. If you think about a traditional way that we interact with computers, we are moving a cursor or a mouse, or even with assistive technology, it requires some muscular input, such as with a sip and puff switch. But with a brain-computer interface, all of that is unnecessary, just being able to harness your thoughts. No, we are not able to read your thoughts exactly right now, but instead we're looking at the patterns of those signals. Take for example, we would put this lovely electrode cap on your head, insert a couple of electrodes, and record the electrical activity from your brain in the form of EEGs. That activity is then translated into a form that the computer understands to then control a device. The same technique can also be used to assess what you're thinking. So in the case of marketing and looking at particular stimuli, we're able to understand how you respond. Ultimately, we hope to improve the quality of life for individuals through the use of brain-computer interfaces, but there's still a ways to go as we move from the clinical setting into the real world.